All right, let me walk you guys through this real quick. Uh, this will be one of those instances where the solution respects the player more than it respects the amp. And what do I mean by that? Well, we're not drilling new holes here, um, but we're working within budgetary constraints. Uh, a younger, hardworking dude, uh, he's a dad of two, uh, two little, little kids. And we're going to do everything we can do to make this thing safe and enjoyable for him to play. Because if you're a dad, then you need stress relief. And that's what this is. So um, here's a solution. Um, the power cord, you can see uh, we had two existing holes in the chassis there. Uh, one is now occupied by what will be the power switch. Um, and then the other is now occupied by, well, um, it's the same function um, for the power cord. We have um, a nice sturdy grommet going through the existing hole. I don't really have any more space to ream out for, um, to be able to install pardon me, that cable clamp or that strain relief clamp, pardon me. Um, um, I did add a cable clamp here uh, to the tra power transformer stud, the one that's over at the, at the four o'clock position right here in the shot. Um, and then here's our, here's our new grounded power cord. You can, um, you can see that I started uh, dismantling uh, the wiring terminations there 